Hi friends, today I'm going to show you how to design your own city using grid paper. You can design a city from the past, present, or even future. For this part of the project, you're going to need graph paper, a ruler, and a pencil. I'm going to be using markers so that you can see my lines better. The line for your city needs to start on the left side of your paper and end on the right side of your paper. Picture this as just a snapshot of your entire city. There's more buildings to the left and more buildings to the right. I'm going to use a ruler for all of my lines so that I can make sure they're straight and not like the Leaning Tower of Pisa. Okay. I want my first building to be tall and I measured how many up and how many down. The shapes of your building can be inspired by your favorite city or they can be completely made up. I'm going to draw a curved line to imitate a bridge. So I counted over one, two, three, four, five, six spaces because six is an even number and I can divide it by two. Six divided by two is three. So I have three spaces over, three spaces up, and now I can draw a curved line for my bridge line down here. Then I can continue building on to my city. This is why it's important to have one single long line instead of a bunch of broken lines. Once you have your city cut out, you're going to trace it on a piece of black paper. Line your city up with the bottom and the side of the paper and use a pencil to trace your lines. Got your paper, make sure to save the negative space as well. Cut it out using one long line. It's so important to stay on your pencil line because now you have your positive space, which is your city, and your negative space, which is the sky around it. For the last step of your project, you're going to be gluing your positive cityscape to your day sky and your negative cityscape to your night sky. After it's glued down, you can use chalk pastels or colored pencils to add details to your cities and to your night sky. You can add as much or as little details as you would like. 